Hi everybody, welcome back to my YouTube channel and welcome to today's video. In today's video, I am doing a simple classic, one of a kind, because it's me, of course. Get ready with me. Uzo of El Padrino asked me to put together the musical entertainment for today's Taco Tuesday, aka she asked me to put together a playlist for tonight. So I decided I was going to dress up, aka put on some makeup and, you know, feel fly for tonight's Taco Tuesday. I'm also using this as an excuse to show you my new skincare routine and a really simple, like straight to the point face of makeup. I'm doing like a really simple straight to the point makeup look and if you're still interested in makeup, you can, you know, watch along and hear me talk about life and hear me talk about things. But before we get started, before we get started, please I am begging you from the very, very bottom of my, my small, pleading hearts to please subscribe to my youtube channel we have been stuck at this 3000 number for quite some time come on guys i know i know there there's somebody there watching that haven't subscribed i don't know why you haven't at this point but please just just do me the honor and subscribing to my channel also please don't forget to click on that notification bell so that you always get notifications of whenever i upload a new video all right i'm out of the shower let's get started with getting ready for this evening so i'm going to be showing you my hair skincare makeup and outfit this is a full get ready with me. you guys know this cleanser it is my ride or die cleanser this is the beauty formulas activated charcoal detox cleanser it is great for washing your face without removing like the essential oils that your skin needs it's very nice very gentle this is the ab facial polish from at baby organics apologies with the packaging i was kind of rough with it cover as you can see is stuck you can already see it's like kind of weird it got stuck so i had to like use force to really get it out but apart from that this is a fantastic product especially if you're dealing with texture and hyperpigmentation because it really contains like really powerful acids to really exfoliate your skin it even comes with a little mini spoon so you can scoop it into your hand without having to put your hand inside the product next is the good molecules nice and my brightening toner i spoke about this toner in my last video and so far so good it's doing me really well just gonna take a couple of drops place it in my palm and press it into my skin if any of you guys have used this toner, please let me know your thoughts on the toner. Next, we are going in with The Ordinary. Remember this brand? This is The Ordinary Alpha Abutene and Hyaluronic Acid Serum. I'm just going to take a couple of drops. I'm all about the hydration, baby. And then for moisturizer, we are using the Simple Light hydrating the simple hydrating light moisturizer this moisturizer is very true to its name it is light it is simple and it is hydrating if you have dry skin there is a version of this product that's much thicker and much rich so you can try it out last but not the least this is the face facts vitamin c eye cream so i have dry under eyes so i have to use eye cream to help Vaseline for my lips because my lips are getting crusty. Now let's move on to hair. I'm going to be using two products for my hair. This is the Birth from Earth More Moisture Shea Veggie Whip. It's a really nice shea, um, shea butter based moisturizer for hair and it smells really good and my hair really likes it. I'm going to mix it in with the Shea Moisture Jamaican Black Castor Oil Strengthen and Restore Leave-In Conditioner. That's a long ass name but it is the name of one of my favorite moisturizers for my hair. It has grown, my God. Look at my hair. I'm gonna take a little bit of this. Also gonna take a little bit of that. I don't need much. Mix it together in the palm of my hand. I gotta comb. <laughs> I'm going to comb out all the tangles, all the little, little stuff. All right, we're done with skincare, we're done with hair. I've even done my eyebrows. Let's get started on the makeup. As I said in the intro, I want to do something really simple, something that you guys are not even want to bother to like see. But if you guys do want to see a full tutorial of the look I'm about to do, let me know. How's everybody been doing? How are we all doing? How's everybody feeling? 2021 has been interesting so far. I mean, I've moved into a new place. But how has 2021 been for everybody? I hope everybody has been doing well and, you know, recovering from the mess that was, 
you know 2020 work for me has been going on really well if you watch my vlog you'd have seen me at work and me just you know earning my 2k i i i can say with my full chest that i earn every inch of my salary every month i love my job it's so informative like i'm constantly reading i'm constantly writing and i'm constantly learning new things about the stock market every day so it's a really fun job especially if you like to learn i really like this job because i really like to learn as i mentioned in the intro uzo of el padrino asked me to put together a little bit of music for tonight now tonight i actually do not have like a playlist tbh i don't have like a fully set playlist what i do have is songs i want to play i know the exact songs i want to play um i don't know the order i'm just going to allow the spirits to kind of take me you know i used to do that a lot at downfall whenever i would play at downfall and i didn't know exactly what to play i would just freestyle it and freestyling it is so much fun but like it's slightly scary at the same time for the whole of last month i actually did not have an apple music subscription like i legit stopped listening to my playlist i stopped listening to new music i i legit just said you know what let me take a break from this music thing and the one thing i found is that i really like music because i felt like my life was like very empty like i felt like something was very very missing i would get songs stuck in my head and not be able to search for the songs because I don't have an Apple Music subscription. So when you don't have an Apple Music subscription, you can't use the, the features, you can't use anything. So it like drove me insane. Sometimes when I get songs stuck in my head, I actually forget the songs. All I know is the song. I don't remember the name, I don't remember the artist. I just don't know that there's a song stuck in my head. Once I got my Apple Music back, I was so happy because I was like, yes. I can now find all the songs stuck in my head because sometimes you have lyrics so you can use lyrics to search on apple music which is what i found very cool there was one edm song that was the hardest song because the edm song did not have a lot of lyrics so finding that song was a challenge tbh but i eventually found the song which makes which made me very very happy because when i have a song stuck in my head it's like i don't know how to explain it I wouldn't say it's violent, but it almost feels violent because the song is just there playing in the background of my brain and I'm like, fuck, what's the name of this fucking song? Sometimes when a song is stuck in your head and you know the name, I feel like it feels better because you're like, okay, I know what is, you know, in my thoughts. But like the fact that I didn't know the name really drove me insane. I'm going to recommend a song to you guys to listen to. It's called The Recipe by aluna kitchenada and rema aluna is an electronic music artist and she released an album last year and one of the songs features nigeria's rema if you like rema's music you'll like that song that song is really fun it's an electronic afrobeat funky kind of song i can't play it because you know i need my money <laughs> youtube is just going to demonetize me like almost immediately so I have to be very careful about the music I play. Right now I get all my music from the YouTube music library because man them don't want no problem. Man them don't want no copyrights. One of my subscribers on the video said that she's gonna be watching all the ads in my video because now that I've moved, I need all my money back, which is very, very true. I really appreciate you. I appreciate you from the bottom of my heart. You can't be playing any music because I don't want YouTube to take my precious small coins away. We are almost done with this look. I'm very proud of myself. I'm proud of my, my makeup abilities because we're just zooming through everything. Again, I don't want this to be like a heavy, serious look. I just want something, you know, light and glowy and just, you know, just there. Barely their makeup, <laughs> says the girl that put like a pound of liquid highlight on her cheekbones. Apologies for the lighting. The sun has decided to hide behind a cloud, which means the light will be coming in and out. I finally decided what I'm going to do in my living room, and I'm decided to go with a couchless living room. Now, in the apartment, so I think I said that this place, the bedroom is much bigger than the living room. So I can have a big ass bed in this room, but I definitely can all have like a nice couch in the living room. And I want a situation where I can have multiple people 
you know, be here at the same time and, you know, all of them having a place to sit, which is why I'm thinking like the couchless living room would work because it'll just be the floor, it'll be throw pillows, it'll be throw blankets, it's going to be comfy AF. You'll want to live on the floor, TBH, by the time I am done. Right now, I'm in search of a nice rug and also I'm going to be buying some throw pillows and throw blankets. I follow a couple of Instagram accounts already. I think I mentioned that once you move and you let the internet know you're moving, your your ads are going to be different. Your ads are going to be very, very, very different. We are almost at the end of this look. In fact, we are at the end. We're doing the lips. I don't know why the Zara lipstick fans don't get the hype they deserve. They are so creamy. And get lip glosses as well. They have some really nice lip glosses. All right, guys, that is it for the look. I told you, short, sweet, and straight to the point. Let me change into my outfit and show you all what I'm wearing today. My outfit today is pretty lame. I'm literally just wearing a bodysuit and a pair of pants, and then I'm gonna wear my sandals. Yeah, I wanted to keep it simple, straight to the point. The bodysuit actually says I'm fantastic, but with the pants pulled up, it makes it look like I'm fun, which in the end makes sense all right guys thank you so much for watching this video i uh, will see you guys in my next one bye